What's up guys, welcome back to the Star Citizen Universe and as you can see I've got some new gear since the first video I did and I'm standing in front of the Mighty Mustang Alpha which uh, I'm actually starting to really enjoy and fall in love with um, so we'll talk about that another time but as you see I've got some new armour I've got a new chest piece, new cool looking helmet and uh, I've got a gun. Oh yeah, I actually got the gun from messing around um, a little while back and managed to pick it up and I've upgraded it. I say upgraded, I put a sight on it and bought a load of ammo for it. Um, and yeah, I bought the armour because the only stuff I had was the stuff that's really designed more for um, carrying items and stuff, like for trading and stuff like that. Um, and what I've got planned today, you can see at the top it says hostile remain in 7 or 7 because I'm going to a security outpost in Korea. I believe it's called Korea. It certainly looks like it's pronounced Korea. And uh, yeah, I thought it'd be better to try and get something to give me a bit more protection. So I went ahead and treated myself with some of the hard earned UEC that I've earned recently. Um, yeah, I went with the chest piece and the helmet that I got because it's a um, not super heavy duty armor piece they weren't that expensive and uh, yeah I think it will be a good all-round armor for the near future uh, hopefully eventually obviously I'll have um, some different sets of armor for different things but I've gone with the Inquisitor core black and a Morningstar black helmet um, and yeah I think that'll be pretty good for now for a start and eventually like I said it'll be cool to get a few different sets there's some really nice looking heavy armor I've seen but um, I thought this would be best now. for now all systems operational launch complete let's get this beauty up in the air well in space thank you and please visit again landing gear retracted Spool up and launch over to there. So yeah, it looks like this is a security mission. I've got to get onto this space station and uh, get inside and take out the targets. And I've got no idea how this is going to go. It'll either go fine or I'm going to absolutely suck. It's been ages, really, um, since I played any form of like first-person shooter. So, um, yeah, this will be interesting. But hopefully it will go well. Um, I'm feeling confident. If not, I'm definitely looking forward to it anyway. It's going to be good fun. And this will be a cool way to showcase, the, hopefully, the um, first-person combat in this game. Because some people don't actually know this is a thing in the game. Um, if you've only just heard of Star Citizen or you've only seen little bits of Star Citizen most stuff you'll see will be like ship related um, and some of the screenshots of the beautiful scenery in the game but um, there's actually a ton of stuff and first person shooting is a part of that oh that's obstructed huh uh, maybe I can jump there and then jump back what's that place right so let's uh, get aboard this station and see what we can get done. I don't think I've got to do anything else in it other than take out the target. So hopefully, if I'm careful, it will be all right. But um, there's a high chance of other players being here as well, so this could get um, turned into a PvP situation. But um, yeah, either way, it should be good fun. Looks like there might be someone else here. This could get a bit rough. There's no doubt they've got a lot more experience than I have. There's a little ship dropped in there, look. Let's go around this side. What am I going to do? Because I've actually seen this is a quite a good thing to do. Is leave my ship running. And for a bit of protection, just keep it under here. Hopefully this will um, keep it safe. I guess it's alright if I turn the power and stuff off. I'm 
and there's a ship right there. So I think some people could just be coming in here to um, reset their chrome stat. I think you can come in here and do that. I'm going to leave my ship there and hope it's going to be alright. Here we go. Just see someone, but I don't know if that was an NPC or a player. I think they're NPCs. This is tense. Why is he not dying? Huh? Oh, what happened there? That was weird. Was there two stacked on top of each other? What the fuck? It says I've killed one of them. Well, that's confused me. Did I lose my guns and stuff? Oh, I do. I lost, lost my gun. Oh, that's annoying. Now all I've got is a pistol. <laughs> I would like to find my gun, but I don't think I can. But, uh, hopefully we're going to pick up another one. I've got a pistol anyway, so that's something. And I just purchased a knife as well in case I pop up behind anyone. Hope we can do a takedown or something like that. Could be a nice addition. Hopefully you don't lose that when you die. Ah, there we go. So I still don't know what happened when I died before. Maybe that was a player sat there, but it was um I thought I killed whoever it was and then someone else was sat right inside him. Wait, what is that? There's a gun. What the hell? Oh they're up there. Get around. I don't want to face him head on with a pistol. Ooh. What's this? Yeah, it got past him, I think. Or just see someone. Oh, 
I need a way up without uh, having to walk up the stairs. I'm shitting my pants. <laughs> this is super intense. I'm stuck on the railing. Get off. Come on. Is there a way of sneaking other than walking? Because I don't think it makes a difference when you're walking. Got him. Total I need is a fucking silencer. I'm actually shitting my pants. Oh my god. Be somewhere safe. I want to check my. Um... No, this looks okay. I want to check what I've got equipped. See if I've got any extra ammo for that gun because it's. Oh, just heard someone. Ah, there we go. It was doubled up. That's what happened to me earlier then. What the hell? Can I light, um, light, light these dudes? Can I loot these dudes? No. Seems to be able to. So what's that happens if I stay that? Let's go up a level. There's someone else in there now. Work quick. So I kept the second weapon I picked up. So maybe if you maybe if you know you're about to die, if you put your weapon away, maybe you keep it. Uh, I don't know. I've kept my knife. I've kept my pistol. Landing complete. How? Engine systems disabled. Oh, I'm back again. Get out. At least this time I've got a uh, SMG with me already. Oh, I shouldn't have died then, man, to that guy. He heard me, though. I don't know. I think that was an NPC, and I was walking, so I don't know whether walking even makes a difference. I think your boots are so heavy and noisy, they don't make that much difference. Maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. 
But also, I was caught my pants down in the middle of the staircase, so it wasn't great. And uh, I was going to open that fire straight away on him, but I was seeing if it was a player, maybe he's just going to run past so I could sneak up behind him or something, but obviously he turned around and nailed me. Let's try this again. That's the guy that killed me, wasn't it? Wish you could take his armor. Yeah, it was a NPC. Right, so there's two left. There was two in the middle earlier. They don't appear to be there now. Just go check the other side, then I'll go up a level. Over here! No! What the fuck? I can't believe it. But I did manage to pick up another gun before I died, so again, I get to go back with a machine gun. This is terrible, but at least oh, I could edit all this out. But I ain't gonna. I'm gonna leave it in. I want you to see how much I fucking suck, and uh, hopefully through my journey in Star Citizen, I will get better. Um, but despite all this, I'm actually really enjoying this. This is great fun. Uh, super nerve wracking sneaking around there. Um, I haven't played any first person shooters for months. And um, it's always nice to get involved in that sort of thing. I do enjoy it. So, um, yeah. It's a good fun. Hope I can get these last two. I'm not going to give up until they're dead. And I want my money. But, um, I think once I got better, it wouldn't actually be a bad way of making money. I mean, you get seven grand for that. Um, again, I don't know what good prices of missions and that are. I'm suspecting, like, seven to ten grand is pretty good for a mission. Um... Especially if you can do it quickly, and I imagine if you got good at doing um, this sort of thing, you would be quick at clearing that out. There's only seven of them, um, so once you got the hang of it, you could smash through them quite quickly. Oh no, what's going on here? Let's get involved, why not? I might regret this, but whatever. Come on. I ain't got no missiles, I reckon this dude might. I don't know what ship this is, I don't even know if I can take this out. Oh, I got it. Well, that's the result. At least we got to uh, blow something up. I'm pretty happy with myself. Managed to take a ship out.
Obviously there was a little bit of help there. I think I got the kill there. Right. Let's get these last two, right. Now where the hell are they now? Four they was round this bit. I think they're there, aren't they? Oh, that's a great ending. We've got a ship kill and finish the uh, mission. Oh, I'm so happy. Yes, we did it. Awesome. Oh, I love this game. Oh, my God. This is fucking amazing. Get out. Oh, do you know what? Is there any more guns? Let's grab another gun. Just so uh, next time I die, we've got a spare. What's that? Retrieve data. Filtration problem. Oh, I wonder what that stuff's about. Uh, I'll check that out later. Right, let's get the hell out of here. Oh my god! There's my ship. Right, how do we get out there? <laughs> Come on! I don't feel like I've completed it till I get in my ship. So how do I get my gun out when I'm in space? Because when I tried to do this before, I started dying for some reason. And when I was trying to get it out earlier to make sure I had one before I went in, it wouldn't get, get one out. So I'm not sure... Let me know down below. Oh boy, we're safely back at Port Olisar. What an awesome mission that was. I really enjoyed that. Oh, I love this game. There's just so much. Um, I know people that have been playing this for ages will say, oh, well, you know, it don't last long. There's a lot, lot of stuff missing. There could be more content. That's fine, but I've just started playing, and uh, I love the fact that there's this different variety of stuff you can play. And like I said earlier, it's so immersive and interactive, um, and it's just amazing. And I'm super hyped after finishing that contract, obviously. Plus, we got the little dogfight at the end as well before we finished off the um, the uh, NPCs, which was a bonus. And uh, yeah, obviously we got the contract done. A bit of a mess. It took me a while, but you know I've got some work to do on my. Um, FPS gaming skills, obviously. It's been ages since... Here come the excuses, by the way. It's been ages since I played a first-person shooter. It's been months. Um, and I think I mentioned earlier, it's something I do enjoy doing. So to have this in the game itself, like, as part of it, is amazing. That you can just go, oh, do you know what? I fancy doing some FPS-style stuff today. And you can go off and do that. Um, obviously, you can PvP like that as well. So, yeah, super hyped for the game still. Really, really enjoyed that contract. And like I said, I think that's cool to show off that part of the game because some of my friends in particular, and my brother, they didn't know that that was part of the game. Obviously, everyone just sees Star Citizen and assume it's about flying ships, which obviously a majority of it is. And uh, that's the appeal of it. Obviously, that's what brought me into it and everybody else, I suspect. But like I said, to have that FPS as part of the game is amazing. Anyway, that's enough waffling on. I really enjoyed that today. I've got a lot of brushing up to do, but we will get there. If you're here for the Star Citizen and stuff, like I've said before, then that's fine. Just stay around, watch the Star Citizen and stuff. But if you're interested in survival games and stuff like that, check out my other content, see what you think. I will try and make Star Citizen videos weekly to go out alongside Atlas and whatever else I might be playing. Um, I don't know if it will be every week, there might be weeks where I don't do a video, but if there isn't, 
then you can assume the next week there will be a Star Citizen video. Um, the reason being, just because obviously I'm just getting into the game, I don't know exactly all the different things I can do, um, I don't know how long things take to do, and what the whether there's anything I need to do before doing certain things. Um, so yeah, having said that, there might be a video every week anyway. I don't know. I know there's one. There was one last week and the week before. There should be one next week. So who knows? But um, yeah, just so everyone's clear on what's going on. And uh, like I said, if you're just here for that, then stick around and watch that. That is all cool with me. But anyway, I've rabbited on enough. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. <laughs>